that fucking part of a uh, what is it? Not Borat, Bruno, where he's talking to that he's talking to that fucking that gay that gay dude that's like a recovered gay that now like he he teaches straight people to be straight, yeah, or gay people to be straight. Yeah. How? <laughs> <laughs> Why are there people out there that believe that, first of all? Oh, he was gay and the Lord fixed him. You can tell anything. No, dude. You can tell anything, just people. Dude, stupid. people believe that shit. We're going to take him over to Glenn. He used to be a faggot, and then the Lord saved him. He's going to save our boy. Yeah. No, you're going to put him in that room with that dude for an hour, and there's going to be all kinds of gay shit happening. <laughs> and then they're both going to cry afterwards, because they're not what you want them to be. Like I, le- I legitimately have no problem with gay people. I don't either. I have a problem with gay people that fucking lie about it. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> I'm not a faggot, dude. I was just checking your dick out just to make sure, like, it was a dick. <laughs> yeah, if you're not okay with yourself, you can't expect other people to be. Yeah, dude. I, that's what I'm saying. Like, fucking, if you're gay, you're gay. I have a problem with chicks with dicks that don't tell me about it beforehand. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you, if that ever happens. That's worse than gay. Right. By a long shot. Like, I would never, I would never go home with a dude, though, and be like, oops, I didn't realize you had a dick. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, it would never yeah. happen. I fucking go home with a chick one day, and she has a dick. It's like, that's just bullshit. You got punked. Where's Ashton? Like, if you can't be around a gay person, this is my thing. If you can't be around a gay person without feeling guilty then you've got some gay shit going on in your head. You know what I mean? Like, dude, people don't really just hate gay people because they're gay. You don't yeah. do that. That's that's hate no matter how you look at it. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's like hating somebody because they're black. It's not their fault. Right. Like, this dude didn't wake up one day like, I'm going to like dicks. Right. You know? It just happened. Like, it just so happens to fucking like dicks. Some people like lemonade, some people don't. Right. That dude likes dicks. Fucking... You can't just hate somebody for that. Right, it's weird, but it doesn't fucking affect you. Right, it doesn't, not at all. Now, like, dude, used to, like, I think I used to think I would freak out if a gay dude, like, hit on me. Yeah. I think now I would just be like, I'm not gay, and don't do it again. <laughs> I, I would be like, I'm not gay, you have good taste. Carry, right. Carry on, do you know any girls? <laughs> right. That you know some hot girls. Gay guy. Dude, gay, guy, gay guys always have hot girlfriends. They do. Like, there's always girls around them that are hot. That's an end. Like you can wingman for me. You cannot touch me. I think I would get like I think I would get like overly annoyed with it, and like I would probably get rage blackout furious if they did it more than like twice. Yeah. They hit on me like more than twice, and I told them not to. Because yeah. at that point, I would just feel like it was weird, and then I would start. I would get like a, like a homophobic fucking. You know what I mean? Yeah. But like the thing is, is like the chances of a gay dude hitting. Like I don't even really know all that many gay people. Right. It's, so, like, I don't think I'm going to put myself in a situation where gay people are going to flirt with me. Yeah, and most of them to, like, know better than to make straight people uncomfortable. Right, and they're not, like... They're wary. Yeah, they're and, they're and they're not, not like, fucking... Just people. because they're gay doesn't mean they're, like, fucking, like, huge sexual deviants that just want to fuck all the time. Like, that is not... That doesn't make... A, just because they're gay doesn't mean they're, like, constantly fucking. There's not, like, constantly gay pornos going on at their house. Right. I think that... I don't even know why we're having this talk. We're just justifying. Why did it even start? Oh, uh, <laughs> what the fuck happened? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Who was I calling gay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm just trying to think back. Did I call somebody gay? I don't know. Pretty sure. It started for a reason, dude. I think you. I think the the girl with the penis thing crossed your brain again. It's so weird, though. Like, first of all, the question. Just like, just like being, being like, in an Xbox party with your friends and somebody asking you that question. Yeah. Is like, dude. I say all kinds of gay shit all the time. I'm always saying gay shit because I think it's funny and everybody else laughs. Like, there's nothing funnier than fucking hearing somebody tell somebody they're going to suck their dick until they die. <laughs> like, I'll kill you, faggot. I'll suck your dick until you're dead. Dude, if somebody calls me a faggot, it's fair game, dude. I'm going to say all kinds of gay shit to you. Like, all right. You called me a faggot. Now you got to deal with this. I'm going to fuck your dad in front of you. I'll suck his dick until he dies. Swear to God. Like, dude, 
that shit to me is funny. But like just busting out in front of your friends, like just talking. It's like me and me and one other guy in a party. I think there might have been two other guys, but he was just like, "Hey, would you fuck a chick with a dick or a dude with a pussy?" What? No. <laughs> You can't put yourself... I can't fuck a girl that looks like a guy. You can't put yourself in that position. Like, that's never going to happen. You, if it ever did happen, you don't know what you would do until you're in that situation. You can't just I do. imagine. I do. You may. I know what I would do in that situation. I would be weirded the fuck out, man. I'm telling you, if I ever... If I am ever out and I, like, for whatever reason, like, I'm ever single and I'm out and I'm, like, trying to hook up with a bitch and I take her home and she's got a dick... I'm gonna be real upset. Yeah. Like I feel like that's entrapment. Yeah. I feel like if if I take a bitch home and we've been making out and like flirting with each other all night, and the first fucking thing that she said to me wasn't, "Hey, I have a dick," like she trapped me because I can't think of any situation where I would like prefer my night to end up with a dick. You know what I mean? Yeah. There's no way that I would ever want that to happen, and and I feel like a chick with a dick would know that. About, like, a straight guy, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, he's not going to want a dick. But I'm going to make him... I'm going to find out for sure. I'm going to make him think that I have a sweet pussy. And we're going to go back to wherever we go and dick. <laughs> <laughs> like, no. I'd be upset. I can't think of a situation where I would ever have to worry about seeing a dude with a pussy. Like, that would never happen. I would never be like, dude... Let me see your dick. What? You got a pussy. That would never happen. You know what I mean? Like, I don't even care. I don't care if there's dudes out there with pussies. I would never. But, like, chicks with dicks piss me off because they're fucking, it's fake, dude. Yeah, it's, it's like, you can. Deceit. It is. It's like, you fucking scandalous bitch, dude. Scandalous fucker. Girls with wieners should have to wear Wranglers. No, I think a girl with a wiener should have to wear a fucking shirt that, or like a or like a fucking you know those things when you go places they give you like hello my name is Zach yeah the the fucking introduction little stickers they should have to ha have one of those that says hello I have a dick uh, my everywhere they go dick haver <laughs> my name's got a dick <clears throat> and you could just see that and and you would like identify with that immediately from across the room and be like I'm not gonna fuck with her right because that typically means she's got a dick. I don't care what's on it. I don't care if it says, hello, my name is Jennifer. Yeah. You would be able to identify with that. See, girl, even if, even if there was a name tag involved, a girl with a dick is too deceitful to be straight up. That shit would just say, like, hello, my name is IP standing up. And you'd be like, that's kind of hot. I've never seen a girl pee standing up. Oh, she has a dick. Like, I would be, I would be, listen, I would, I, obviously I don't ever want to catch anything. But I would be less pissed off, okay, if I went and caught, like, fucking gonorrhea or syphilis or something. Yeah. And some bitch had it and just didn't tell me and gave it to me. I would be less pissed off than if she had a dick. Yeah, it's Like, different. when we got back somewhere and I just seen a dick and I was like... And then you're in an awkward situation where you gotta be, like, f killing something. You know what I mean? Like, because I'm pretty sure I would freak the fuck out. The dick is pretty much an STD. But worse, like dude. That girl has dick and she wants to give it to you. It's like, dude, all I all I thought about is fucking you, and now I never even thought about the fact that there's going to be a dick in the equation. <clears throat> Can I get a twelve pack of Coke. <laughs>